All evening long, trying to win the ball back to get his head up and find his man. They would have been in again. Really need to make the most of those opportunities. It's also the first time that Arsenal have been involved in it since the inaugural campaign. Back. Good composure by Alex Kirk. And I tell you what, Jack Henry Francis isn't a bad option to have in those tight areas. Seems to uh, welcome the pressure that feet do the talking, and they definitely are. Here's Henry Francis into Hutchinson. Rides a challenge. Good body feint by Joel Lopez to retain possession. Now here's all. Bournemouth defenders don't know whether he's coming or going, twisting or turning. Flores. In the field. This may have presented itself for Henry Francis. Changing at will. Yeah, it's really fluid. I'm sure that Kevin Betsy and Mikel Arteta as well. Been Arsenal standout so far once again. Getting into that space between the... A nice bit of uh, midfield craft by Ben Cottrell, who's uh, quietly having a, a very effective performance. He can whip in a, a brilliant pass. Tackles that they've made in the Bournemouth half. I'd love to see those stats because they've been all over the cherries when they've been in possession. If you're not moving up with the defence, it's then easy to be flagged offside. Exemplary so far. Beerus now into the penalty area. There goes Swanson on the overlap. Straight across the face of goal. And there's a second goal for Arsenal. And it's Jack Henry Francis, the man who started the move, actually, on the edge of his own penalty area. He was the Arsenal player exploiting the space. He was able to capitalise and be the poacher inside the area to make it Arsenal 2, Bournemouth 0. Yeah, and Jack Henry Francis really deserves that goal. So often, Max, you see him, don't you, on the edge of his own box, starting moves off. What you don't often see is him getting on the other end of them and finishing them. Again, I just want to highlight the role of Amari Hutchinson. Henry Francis, scorer of the second goal for the Young Gunners. Well, Conquer came a long way there. Managed to get enough on his punch, and Henry Francis will sweep up the rest. And to BRF on this near side. Hutchinson. Henry Francis receiving the ball under plenty of pressure. Card to be shown to an Arsenal player. So Mazida Gungbo in the book. Again, the option is Henry Francis in the deep lying midfield area. Swanson does have the ability to. Difficult, especially with Arsenal's back four as settled as it is at the moment that the Gunners do have as well. But as we said in the first half, Kel Arteta, so for the likes of Kirk or and Gungbo, this is a really good chance for them. See Amario Cozia Dubri coming off the bench. Certainly a youngster. You're a, a massive fan of Jack Henry Francis, aren't you? Oh, Henry Francis, of course, yeah. yeah he just does the simple thing so well. He can also play passes like that to find Hutchinson here. Going for the far corner. Nothing too fast for the Gunners to top the group. But what we've seen from them in the opening 70 minutes or so of this game has been really impressive. You, you think if they can find another goal, that will... Henry Francis out to Walters. Now back with the young Arsenal midfielder. Who's your Dubry? Lee Cup playing away to uh, Sheffield with a uh, game to close out here, though. As the clock runs down, I know that there's Arsenal still very much in possession.